If you didn't hear, tomorrow is going to be an ozone action day here in North Texas. And new at 10 o'clock, Aaron Jones talking to local doctors about what that means and the impact that air pollution has on you. Barry Neal pays attention to the air quality index on his phone. There it is. But says even on a bad day. It doesn't stop whatever I have to do that day. Um, I don't know how many people in Dallas carpool, you know, when they say it'd be a good idea to ride share today, but this town's addicted to driving their cars. Local doctors who specialize in the respiratory system say as DFW continues to grow, more cars on the road and more construction has led to more pollution in the air. There have been studies that shown that increased pollution does, in, does lead to increased risk for long-term health consequences such as increased risk of developing COPD or increased risk of developing cardiovascular disease. Dr. Zachary Dreyfus with Methodist Health System says it's the people with chronic health conditions like asthma and COPD that this can really impact. Um, it can certainly trigger their asthma or their COPD to flare up. It's just going to irritate the lining um, of the lungs themselves. He says when it comes to the average healthy person, they do not need to be limiting their time outdoors. However, the pollution mixed with the allergens can be a bad combination. Texas is full of allergens and with everything else in the air and you're just got a, a potent mix that can easily trigger uh, people to feel like they're getting a little bit more short of breath than usual. I know lots of people that suffer usually when the, when the season changes. Overall, health experts say it's best to listen to your body, and if it's telling you to take it easy, take it easy. In Dallas, Aaron Jones, CBS 11 News.